played right now by Bennett. As it's sent over to Dusak. Dusak playing it to the trailer and 44. A nice move to Dusak. That shot. He scores! Wow. What a score. He puts the black flying saucer into the back of the net. And it's 1-0 Red Wings. He was set up perfectly in position. He took that, went right to the right of the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper had no chance to stop that one. And it's 1-0 our first score of the game in the first period. They've been outshot. Six shots on goal for the Mustangs. Five for the Red Wings. And I think also, uh, if, you know, I think if you're uh, St. Reed, I think you can get confidence just by getting shots on goal. Kind of build your team's confidence to know that you can get that close. But again, it's not going to be easy to score on this team. It hasn't been easy for anybody to score on Bennett all year long. So uh, right now, again, it's 1-0. We've still got 23 left in the first period. Can they even things up or at least stay down by just a goal? Out behind the net to Wilkins. Schley scores! And right on cue, just as I said, let's stick it to one goal. How about they don't do that? They score another one, it's 2 nothing. To Wilkins, to Schley, and that's all she wrote. 2 nothing already, and unless something can be made and adjusted by St. Rita, might be another blowout victory for the Red Wings tonight. I just can't tell if they're improv or if they're just like, you know, they're, they're playing a little bit. They almost seem a little bit too playing. Over to the face-off dot. Look at that pass, and shoots, he scores! St. Rita scores. I believe they're gonna credit it Wait for a number. It's gonna be number 14, Nathan Tracy. But partner, that goal happened because of the beautiful pass by Christopher Vari. Yeah, unbelievable pass, unbelievable goal. There was nothing that the uh, goalie could have done there. And just like that, though, now we're looking at a 2-1 game. Just getting one goal back, and now the confidence right. can change, momentum can change, and now they're playing with a little bit of different energy. I will say that this is, has slowed down a lot since the, the, the first period. I feel like they're not quite as aggressive. That's a goal for Bennett. He puts the black flying saucer into the back of the net, and it's 3-1 Red Wings. They're gonna credit it to Jack Vogt. And we're just talking about the confidence going back up. And just like that, we're back to square one with a two-goal deficit. Talk about a dagger into the hearts of St. <laughs> Rita's faithful right after they looked like they were going to get back into it. Huge goal by Jack Vogt. St. Rita for them to win this game. They're going to have to play outside their comfort zone. And, and really, they're outside their comfort zone because it's already three goals scored for the Red Wings. Nice pass. Breakaway one coming one. up for St. Rita. Here go. Pass. Shot. I think he scored that. And he did score. He did. Wow, Just Goal. like that, we have an interesting game on our hands. Yeah. Two. Bennett's got to do a better job of getting back. Way too aggressive. He'd like to be behind the blue line, not in front of it. And another goal scored for Nathan Tracy. He's got both of their goals thus far. Back over to neutral ice. Pushing it into the zone. Three on two, shot. Pat wow, saving the beauty nice by Cisla. Big so, save. Yeah, it was off the stick of Jed Licka. Twice six and one. Vari with it. Vari, no look pass. Backhander in the slot. Puck still loose. Another try for St. Rita. That wrister. He scores. What a goal. Antonino Gentile. We're all knotted up at three. That's why he leads the Mustangs in goal score. That's why they play the game, right? Down two nothing. You were the heavy underdog, you come back, and now it's just like that, we're 3 3. It seems like they have a very good combination between Vari and Tracy. And here's a breakaway coming up for the Mustangs. Couldn't get much on it, but he scores anyways. Didn't get much on the shot, but Vari scores anyways. And one of the few mistakes that Benjamin Cecil has made all year. We're going to watch it on replay in a second. They were complaining about something, and I'm not sure what it was. They were complaining it was offside. Oh boy, there was really nothing on that shot by Vari, and what a break for the Mustangs. They don't trail very often. Look, they're at home. We still got plenty of time. 46 seconds remaining in this period. Here's another breakaway. That shot, he scores! Wow! Antonino Gentile, and now the Red Wings are hurting a little bit. 
Yeah, a lot of it. And again, <laughs> this is the color footage I'm talking about. They're playing free, they're playing loose, they know they have control. Now they know they can beat this team. And when you know you can beat a team like that, regardless of where, especially when you go down 2 nothing early, I mean, that's, that's five to one since that 2 nothing gets in their face. Well, if it's one game, you know, you, you got to move on to the next game. But it, you would think it's going to help their confidence knowing that just because they start, that's a goal, a power play goal. How about that one from Bennett? I, I just can't read this game. This might be a 7-6 final today. No goal goalie is very good today. Excellent shot, though, and there to finish it is Carson Stone. And don't go anywhere. We got ourselves a hockey game once again. 107 to go. It's a goal! I'm gonna watch it on replay. That's kind of miraculous how that happened. But a goal credited to DeCozla and Nolan. After all that, we might have ourselves overtime hockey tonight. We might have ourselves overtime hockey is right. One of four left, wow. Wide open in front, oh, calls for it, and good job Pope that. checking it away. O'Malley called for it, who had a costly penalty earlier. Remember, it was 5-3. Here we go, breakaway for the Red Wings. Dusak shoots, he scores! That'll do it. What a play, what a breakaway, and Look what at a this. score. The socks and sandals, he goes up to greet the players. <laughs> Wow, are you kidding me, Kyle? What a game. I don't know if that's how Andrew Schley wanted to draw up the victory tonight, but they're down five to three. They score on the five on three, and then a goal that should not have happened. Morgan allowed it in, and the breakaway goal for Thomas Dusak.